God bless America, land of the free. God bless Supreme and the North Face and Antarctic and I don't know what else and Gorter. Back up through with helicopters, buku blades and hella choppers. Looking like a dollar be a dollar, we'll be grassing in the lawn. Who the fuck else dare to stop? A bitch come through, blue face, turn it to do state, but nothing you bring to All right, YouTube, what is? Cracking. Welcome back to the channel. Overall, I was very happy and we were very successful this week. Week 6, the North Face Supreme. But before we got these items, man, this week had me tore the fuck up. Like, for three days before, I was just tripping in my head back and forth. Like, in the store, it gets crazy. The lines get crazy. People finesse. It's just a fucking shit show out there. But... We did come through and we did very well and I was very happy about that. We got a lot of stuff to keep. We got a lot of stuff for the homies. And we got a lot of stuff for you guys to win in raffles for dirt cheap to buy. Whatever you guys want to do. So make sure you go to Preem Population on Instagram. I'll leave it on the screen. Follow that Instagram. We've already raffled some shit and sold some shit of these items. We raffled a North Face Gore-Tex suit. The black top I'm wearing and pants together the entire suit we raffled it for 20 fucking bucks and some dude won it for $20 so premium population on Instagram go follow that we're gonna do raffles all day today all day tomorrow and we are gonna run it like that so without further ado let's get into the pickups before this video ends up 20 minutes I'm gonna show you guys the fleece first just because that is my favorite item of the entire drop. So here is the yellow fleece. This is a size small. I believe Alexander's gonna keep this, I'm not sure. On one side of your sleeve, you got the Antarctic patch, and then on the other side of the sleeve, you have Supreme and the North Face. This is like the tagging they put on every fucking jacket that they make. The American flag on the back that people were hating on, but honestly, I think that shit is so badass. And then you got red embroidered North Face, and then you got a pocket here, and two pockets here. This is a beautiful yellow fleece jacket, and this red just pops off this shit. Ronald McDonald or not, this jacket is hard as fuck. The fleece is definitely, like I said, my favorite out of the Gore-Tex or the fleece. And look at this red one, dude. This is a size large. This thing is absolutely beautiful. Look at the white coming off this red. And then, of course, you got your box logo on the back of your neck. And then the same patching on the sleeves. And then a fat-ass flag on the back as well. And then the insides of these match like the accents on the outside, man. These I would put this on if I didn't have this big ass jacket on. But man, these things are so beautiful. And I actually copped a yellow large manual when they dropped. So shout out to the manual gang. And if you copped anything North Face manual, make sure you leave it in the comments and let me know what the motherfucking deal is. Let's get into the pants. One small black and one small yellow. Here's the black ones, which I think are sick. As you can see on the knee pads, you got North Face and Gore-Tex. And then up here on the thigh area, you got Supreme and North Face on your tagging. And then these are all black with the American flag right here. Zipper in the back, zipper on the side. I do think these things are sick. I like the black ones. Just the colors that came out were so crazy and so sick. It's just like my heart just goes directly to the colors. Look at these yellow pants, dude. Oh my lord. With these red knee pads, Gore-Tex, North Face, and then you, got, you still got the black accents on all the colors. That's why I like it. And then you got the American flag, and the inside of these pants are all fucking red. Man, I've been wearing these pants for like two days since I got them. Just inside my house doing the trash, doing my chores. Fucking, I almost took a shower with these things on. I do not want to take them off. This is all embroidered, all embroidered, embroidered patch, patch. These things are just so sick. These retailed at $400 after tax, but man, oh man, these pants are so sexy. 
and I am just going to have such a hard time getting rid of those yellow ones. I'm not sure if I actually will. So let's get into the headbands. Here's the blue one right here. As you can see up front, there's like an Antarctic patch and then it says North Face on one side and Supreme on the other. And then there's a red and black one too. There's a black on black, a blue on blue, and then a red on black, which is right here. I mean, these things are sick, don't get me wrong. I like these a lot. It's just, uh, and I do have long hair, but I guess my hair is just not long enough to use these headbands. But I'm definitely gonna be raffling these. If you guys wanna win one of these headbands for 10 bucks, pre-population on motherfucking Instagram. So we still have some uh, North Face stuff, but let's get into the lookbook items because please do not sleep on lookbook items, dude. These things are sick as fuck. Look at this felt shadow crew neck right here, dude. Holy hell, this thing is absolutely beautiful. All these letters are like cut and sewn on here, this little felt soft material. This is the gray one and it has navy accents. Look at this, it's gray and then it goes to navy. And then on your cuffs, it's all gray and navy. Other side, all gray and navy. And then down on the ribbing, it's all color blocked and uh, it's cut and sewn. This thing was $148, but it is so fucking worth it. This is a size large. This thing is absolutely beautiful. I think we already raffled this off. Somebody won this for 10 fucking bucks, dude. So this thing is so sick. And Alexandra did get one as well, but she got it in a small. I'm not sure if she's going to keep it or not, but damn, this red one is so bad. I don't know why. I just love red and yellow, and it's starting to hurt me, dude, because a lot of my pieces that I'm keeping for my personal end up being red. But look at the yellow popping off this red, and then fuck the yellow accents dude you got white accents all along your cuffs and ribbing and this thing is just absolutely beautiful size small this thing will fit a little dwarf or midget but damn this thing is so sick and I'm talking shit Alexandra is a size small so but damn this thing is so sick felt shadow crew neck those things were dope as fuck another lookbook item that dropped was of course this full bar sweatshirt I had the red one, but I already gave it to the homie, so I don't have it. Here's a black one. You can't really tell it's a full bar. This one really just says Supreme. But if you look up close, there's like a black bar that goes all the way right here. And on the sweatshirts that aren't black, the, the bar is a different color. So like the red one had white writing and then like a white bar going all the way down. And the blue one had like a yellow bar and they were super fucking sick. So here's the black one. It doesn't really do justice for the name of it, but Supreme all the way across the front, cut and sewn embroidered letters all the way across. This thing is absolutely beautiful. Please, even on a big collaboration, do not sleep on the lookbook items because there is fire always dropping with the collaborations or not. Let's get into the big haul bags, man. These things are so badass. These things are heavy as fuck. This material is just waterproof, windproof, and fucking baby proof and all this shit, dude. Look at the side, just branding everywhere. Supreme North Face, on the front you got a fat ass flag with the Antarctic patch. On the other side you got Supreme North Face again. On the top, Supreme North Face, and then on the back, you got a little place you could put your name tag in here in case you want to send your kid to school with this. You can put his name in here, but damn, look at this fucking backpack, dude. These things are so badass. You can fucking put literally 13 babies in here and 10 pounds of marijuana, and this thing would fucking still have half the room left dude this thing is so badass this is the black one which is black and white so that's tight a lot of people like this one because they're boring and bland as fuck and their soul is black uh so they like this kind of shit this thing is so sick this material is like this half rubber half plastic material you got a zip pocket in the front and then you just got a huge fucking deep ass, that's like a fucking deep, dark, like dark fucking hole in there, dude. Do not get lost in that shit. But damn, and then it has like a little buckle closure on the front right here. I was so excited for these bags. 
And uh, I still am, dude. I fucking love these. Definitely gonna off the black one and the red one. And then here is the yellow one, which I will probably keep for myself. Just because I fucking love the yellow shit, dude. Everybody clowns because it looks like Ronald McDonald, but I do not give a fuck, dude. Look at this red coming off the yellow. Supreme North Face, Supreme North Face, and then on the front, bam, a fat ass thing. You got your scraps right here, and then inside this thing is just like I said, dude. Just You just do not want to get lost in there. You got mesh and a zipper right here. These things are absolutely beautiful and they really weren't even that expensive they were like 180 bucks after tax i think i'm definitely gonna have to keep the motherfucking yellow one let's get into a couple hats that we got of course the uh the classic logos dropped and i am crazy about classic logos these were the multicolor ones here's the black one which ended up just being white writing so I had to grab one for the personal. This hat is so clean and so fucking sexy. Of course, no multicolor on this one. It's just white. I'm sorry the contrast. You guys can't see it. But it does say Supreme New York all embroidered white on white. That's for the personal. And look at this pink one, dude, with all these multicolor Supreme New York. This is for the personal. And then we did get an olive one right here, which I think this one's sick as fuck. I'm not going to keep it, but damn, all these classic logo hats were straight fire. A bunch of them I'm keeping. Here's the collegiate logo t-shirt right here. This is in red. Everybody was telling me like, oh, those letters aren't cut and so and what the fuck. I was like, bro, get the fuck out of here. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about, dude. Supreme all the way across the front. Each one of these letters is cut and sewn on here. This nice, thick-ass material. And then, of course, you got your Supreme branding down in the corner. Like I said, I do not have a problem spending $80 on these t-shirts because they are 100% worth it. And these shirts are sturdy and sexy and just dope as hell all the way around. So let's get into the Gore-Texes, fuck the bullshit, and uh, let's get into these, man. Here's the blue one. Obviously, I have the black one on, but I will show you guys the blue one. It's like a dark royal blue, and then it has this baby blue on the inside, and then I will get to all the branding. Up on your shoulder, Supreme North Face, and then you got Gore-Tex. This is all embroidered. You have your Supreme North Face patch on one side, your Antarctica Antarctic patch on the other, and then you got this American flag right here. This fucking Velcro's out, and then you have a fat ass zipper in the front again. You might be able to store like, I don't know, half a pound of weed in there if you really wanted to. And then you got pockets down here, pockets down here. Flip and dip, shout out to Paul Cantu. You got your flag on the back, and look at this hood, all branded, embroidered Gore-Tex, fat ass thread count, embroidered Supreme, and then embroidered North Face on the other side. And then, man, this thing is just so sick. The blue one really wasn't my favorite, uh, but I did grab it. Let's get into probably my favorite one, which was the red one right here, dude. Look at this fucking jacket, dude. All fucking red with white accents, and then you got red embroidery, fat ass flag on the back, Supreme North Face on the side, and look at this white on the inside of here. Look at this thread count out the booty right here. Man, this jacket is so sick with all the white accents, and then I have the black one on, of course. But we did not grab the yellow one, but it's all good. You just can't win them all out here, man. But we did very good. And then I think there's one more item that I will show you guys, and that is this Pills ceramic tray right here that we did grab a couple motherfucking times. Here's the tray, and then up close, as, you got, as I told you guys in the preview, it just has a bunch of pills on it, and the pills say Supreme, uh, which is pretty sick. It's ceramic, like glass. And then on the back, you got a box logo right there. So all around, man, we were very successful. I still have more shit, dude. Like I got this Terry crew neck and peach and I got the fucking rugby, but we were just running out of time, dude. The video's already fucking 15 minutes long, dude. So I'm probably going to keep the yellow bag, the yellow pants and the red fleece. That's what I'm going to keep. Alexandra's probably going to keep the yellow fleece. 
the bar logo hoodie, the crew neck. I don't know. We're going to keep a bunch of stuff, but we still got a bunch of stuff to raffle off. That was all of the North Face shit. Most of the lookbook items, hats, backpacks. We fucking did so well, and I'm just very happy. Uh, but we do have a lot of product to get off. So go to Premium Population and join the raffles and join the fun and win some shit for dirt fucking cheap. Thank you guys for the support and I will be announcing the giveaway tomorrow. Whoever wins the friends and family box logo, you will know tomorrow on my Instagram. So stay posted on there and thank you guys for the support, man. Next week we're going hard. We're going to be back out there giving you guys footage and tomorrow there will be a vlog. So if you guys waited for this video, I hope it was worth it. And I hope you guys got the visual representation that you needed. And uh, I hope you guys are excited for the vlog, man. Thank you for the support. Follow me on Instagram, at Leroy Destroy, Prim Population. And uh, let's get it. Love all you guys. Peace, deuces. Tomorrow's the vlog. Be excited because it's some dope-ass footage. Gore-Tex, motherfucker. Bitch. One up, never love the half dozen. Now who the fuck else wanna talk shit? Now who the fuck else wanna get ripped?